Today we are doing a fast paced warm up for strength. Just remember to still maintain that integrity of that activation. Welcome back to Life Full of Zest and thank you for joining me on the mat today. If you would like to have more of a longer warm up, I would recommend that you click on one of our other warm up videos and then come back to this one. Otherwise, I will start you off with a quick five minute warm up before we get into our fun little intensive session. Let's start in the center of our mats. In an all fours position, we're slowly going to make sure that we are in that correct posture, wrists comfortably under those shoulders, knees comfortably under those hips, and we're slowly going to inhale, and on that exhale, open that right arm up towards the ceiling, and back to center, and same thing with that other side, opening up, and back to center and we're going to do three of these on each side and last one all the way up and down and all the way up and down and slowly extending right leg off the floor then left leg into that front support position and lifting your glutes up towards the ceiling so that we can push our head through those arms, pushing those shoulders towards the ground as we push those heels into the ground and slowly walking those hands towards those feet and bending that right knee as we push that left heel into the ground. And we're just going to walk those calves out and slowly Walking those hands back to the end of the mat into a front support position. We're going to hold for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Lifting that head through those arms, lifting those glutes back up towards the ceiling and pushing both heels back into the ground. And we're walking those heels out again and getting ready for our 10 second hold and lifting back forward dropping that pelvis and putting that neck in neutral and holding for 10 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 1 and slowly dropping those knees in and leaning into that rest position walking those hands towards the left hand side as we open that right rib and walking over towards the other side as we open that left rib and slowly back to center opening that chest pushing the pelvis into the ground to stretch out those abdominals and slowly coming back into that all fours position and we are ready for our warm-up let's extend that right leg up then that left leg we are going to be doing push-ups if you do struggle with push-ups a modification is just doing it with your knees tucked in and when we do our knee tucks you can just lift that leg up in that sequence so let's get into that push-up i'm going to show you that sequence and then we'll continue so chest touch chest touch knee tuck knee tuck into push-up and we are going to be doing eight of these. So when you're ready, let's get into those positions. Let's inhale, exhale, chest touch, chest touch, knee tuck, knee tuck, push up. That's one. And two. Three. Four, we halfway, keep going. Five, keeping core tight. Six, seven, and eight. And dropping those knees in, leaning into rest position and turning over onto your left hand side. Sequence is as follows. You're lifting yourself up into a side plank position, extending that right leg and we're doing a limb tap as we reach arm overhead and then hip drop and that's the sequence. Doing eight of these, deep breath in, exhale arm overhead as we toe tap. That's one and two, 
and three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. And holding for ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and turning over to do that same thing on the other side. Just try to keep a distinction between the two movements. You are lifting into that side plank position. It's a limb drop back up into that hip drop as you keep that knee in position. That's two. Keeping core tight. Three and reaching. Four. And five. Six. Ready to hold for 10 seconds after this eighth count. That's seven and eight. And holding for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And slowly coming down, we are going to turn over onto our backs to do our final sequence. And then we repeat. So let's keep working. We're building up a sweat. But that's what we want, so keep pushing. We are going to lift our legs up and extend them up towards the ceiling. We are interlacing hands behind the head and just at a 45 degree angle, we're keeping those legs in that position and we are slowly lifting head, neck and chest off the ground as we lower slightly back up and slowly down. That's one. Two, three, four, five, six. Lower the head, lift the head, lower the legs, lift the legs, and let's do one more after this. And slowly hugging those knees to chest and slowing that heart rate down. Before we do that entire sequence, two more times. I hope you're ready. I hope you're prepared to push through that muscle burn. Let's lift into that push-up position. Deep breath in and chest touch, chest touch, knee tuck, knee tuck, push up. That's one. Knee tuck, knee tuck two try not to lift those shoulders towards your ears making sure that you are stabilizing nicely and we are halfway we've got four more so keep working that's one keeping those elbows tucked in that's two. And last one. And let's push through. You're gonna hold for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Dropping those knees and leaning back into race position. Very nice. Let's turn over onto our left hand sides getting ready for that side plank remember hips high hips stacked shoulders stacked lifting up arm to t point and that's one straight into that hip drop two three four five six seven and remember 10 second hold, flexing that ankle, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and slowly down, turning over onto your right hand side. Let's keep working. We are stacking the shoulders and hips, crisp shoulder positioning, lifting up, and inhale, exhale, toe tap as you bring arm overhead, that's one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 
three, hip high, four, five, three more, six, seven, eight, and up and holding for ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and slowly down, turning onto your backs to do that core sequence, lifting legs up and extending them towards the ceiling, interlacing hands behind your head, inhale, exhale, lower those legs as we lift that head, bring that those legs back to center, lower the head, lift head, neck and chest, lower those legs, that's two. Three, four, five, six, making sure you're not bracing, seven, and eight, and we're going to hold here for ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and hugging those knees towards your chest and allow that body to rest and recover as we prepare for that final sequence well done everyone last little push turning over onto that front support position getting ready for our chest touches and push-ups and let's go inhale and exhale chest touch chest touch knee tuck knee tuck push up that's one two remember those shoulders remember those feet keeping that good posture three sucking belly to spine and trying not to slant from side to side as you chest touch and knee tuck Keep going. We've got three more. That's one. Two. Last one, and we're going to hold for 10 seconds. I can barely to spine. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Dropping those knees. And leaning into rest position. I hope you are feeling just as hot and tired as I am. It means you're working hard and turning over onto our sides to do our final side sequence. Let's keep working. Deep breath in, exhale, lifting into that side plank position. And remember, toe tap into hip drop. And inhale, exhale toe tap and hip drop that's one two three four keeping hips forward five six seven remember to hold for ten seconds and holding for flexing that ankle eight seven six five four three two one and slowly turning over onto that right hand side and stacking that shoulder stacking those hips lifting that upper leg off the floor arm to t point inhale exhale dropping those limbs back to center and hip drop that's one and two and three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and holding for ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and slowly down. Last little push on your backs to do our little ab sequence 
right leg up left leg up extending those feet towards the ceiling and lifting head neck and chest off the floor and lowering that leg down back to center dropping head neck and chest and that's one lowering those legs two three four five six seven eight and holding for ten nine eight seven six five four three two one and slowly hugging those knees towards your chest thanks for joining me on the mat i don't know about you but i feel like i've worked pretty hard if you do find that those sequences are a little bit too long then just like i always say stop rest get back into the correct posture and then get straight back into it if you want a good cool down hit on the video above and you can enjoy a nice calming relaxing static cool down see you in the next video